Okay, this is a good question. So how Raygat work? How how this this device works? Uh, I asked myself many times how it could work this device. So it looked nothing. Yeah, see, but actually it works. Uh, let let me say briefly how it works. Actually, it is not so it's not so simple. There is a, a lot of uh, scientific backgrounds, but I will try to give you in a way that is possible to understand. So first of all, inside of the device that uh, is uh, an air filter, so actually this is the definitions of uh, Rhaegar, is an air filter. And inside there are two small tubules that have the shape of the DNA, two helicoids, that have the shape of the DNA. And uh, in the centers, there is a, another tube, a straight forward tubes, that contains uh, uh, several minerals in size. Now, do we know that each uh, set of minerals have its own frequencies. Uh, it's been done long study. I don't think this is the place where to repeat about this. Uh, but minerals have their own frequencies. And because they belong to the family of stones, their frequencies is steady. Eh? Like you can imagine a mountain is steady, don't move, don't shake. Sometimes shakes, but not that much, even with big earthquakes. It's the most steady things on these planets. And a minerals <coughs> is the smallest, it's a teeny parts of a mountain. Let me give this uh, example. Now, we have two components. One is a minerals that have a steady frequencies and the others mimic, that means reproduce, the shape of our DNA. The DNA, everybody knows, is the structures of our genetic codes. It contains the structures of our genetic codes. And uh, we discover that electromagnetic pollutions mainly affect the functioning of the DNA. So it works at a very teeny uh, level works at the cellular level. Uh, the principle in which Rhaegar work is first it maintains the surface around, the space around at a certain frequency, a frequency that will not be affected by the changing of the main frequency that surrounds normally our lives, and especially in motor city. And so I refer radio emissions, PC emissions, light emissions, and so on. All these emissions, uh, electronic emissions, they influence uh, our DNA, and they influence our body. And many studies have been done by Regards in this uh, respect, especially by the CNR in Italy, the Center for National Research. More simply, it works like this. Let me say that you are taking a picture, but the light is not so good. So you need to add a filter in front of your uh, lens and we call this filter polarized filters. So what the polarized filters is doing? Simply it put all the light that's going into the lens in a better way. There is not only a primary light that goes in and make everything foggy, but the filters lets all the light to go smoothly and directly into the lens. This mainly is what Regard is doing. It works at our cellular levels. And this is mainly why the science could not prove that mobile phones, radiations, uh, electrical radiations, <coughs> red, uh, emitted by radio devices, any kind of radio device, not only radio phones, also cordless at home, also Wi-Fi, uh, can arm or not arm organs. Mainly, the science, uh, the medical science, focus on organs. And it's very difficult for radio waves to affect directly the organs. Firstly, affect the cells. Then, if too much exposures, like X-ray, for example, it begins to damage the tissue. Then, when the tissues are too much exposed, then finally the organ collapse because this is how we are done. First we are cellular, then we are tissue, then we are organs. So Reagan works first at the cellular level. Keep our cell 
in a shape, in a protection, under a polarized filter, let me say like this, not to shakes due to the interference of others' uh, emissions. This is how Regard works.